Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time on live television, it's Fool's Garden. Hallo, Servus, grüezi miteinander. Grüezi. Ich bin der Peter. Ich bin der Volker. Und zusammen sind wir Fool's Garden. Hi, my name is Peter from the Fool's Garden. Wait a minute, just have a look outside. Afterwards, I'll show you my room and then we go downstairs to Mr. Hinkle. Mr. Hinkle. Because he's just having breakfast. Have you seen Mr. Hinkle? Hi. Mr. Hinkle. Not yet. No. Hi. No. 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 Something to say. I will climb the highest mountain for you, and I will cross every ocean. Mr. Hinkle, I was just trying to visit you downstairs in the lobby. So that's why we have to go upstairs again. Actually, it's hard work because you have to sit down and tell yourself now we are writing a new song and then you just wait for that, that somebody has an idea that comes up with an idea I mean what we did this time was we met in a very special place um, it's in the black forest and um, strip by no forest. no it's like it's like a really private place in the on a hill and it's a small small uh, house very small and it's just just one room and there's no equipment in it i mean other than one piano one guitar and maybe one bass and we just met there had maybe one bottle of wine just playing a bit and then we found oh that's that, that's interesting oh let's do that oh let's check this one and peter comes with that melody and with that, and then it develops you know and you just get if you get that flow you just have to grab it and then work on it i mean that's hard work then because this to be creative you cannot be creative on like no you have to be creative so it just it comes or it, it doesn't come in former times we we went to miami for example in a, in a flat of a, of a friend and then we for example we wrote a song in Miami Beach where it was always the sun was always shining and we wrote a song called rain so you cannot tell where's this inspiration coming from I mean it was just there and we just did it and we just said oh that's a cool idea to write a song called rain I so sure you have to have the time to sit down and to think about like if you have an idea or if you have a, had an idea at home and you had actually no time to develop it. And then you find some time together. And then now we have time. Now we can really focus on, th on this or that idea. And it's like being creative, but, but you have to get this kick in the ass to do that. For me, an inspiration can, can be a, a, sign, a sign for a city like 25 miles to Kissimmee. It can be a sentence somebody tells you like, Peggy in go and ask Peggy for the principal thing when when he, we were talking about the weather and he said the sun is going to come out t tomorrow and I said oh that's great and he said that's the principal thing and I thought wow wow this is a great song title. When Lemon Tree came out in the UK for example, no it was not a mistake. No it was not a mistake. But I mean yeah, you can say it, yeah yeah sure but it came out. And then it has to pass like, I mean, it has to pass Radio 1 and at the BBC. This is the main, the main uh, radio station. So, and the BBC said, oh, yes, we want to play, but can we have more strings in the chorus? And then, and then the guy from the record company came to us and said, oh, the BBC, they want to play, but they want to have more strings in the chorus. And we said, fuck them. They should play it like it is, because it's, it's a hit everywhere. Over. It's in Scotland number one, it's number one in Ireland, it's not fucking. We don't do fucking strings in the in the chorus. And if I would, if somebody would say to that, that to me now, I, I would give them like a fucking strings, whatever. I mean, I, I wouldn't care about. But at that time, we were proud to say no, play it like it is, or fuck you. And then they fucked us because it was they just like <laughs> they didn't play it, and it was just like going to number 26 or 23 uh, into the into the charts in the UK because there was less strings in the chorus and and if I think of it 
if it now I think see, that's that was a crazy that was a fool's garden story. I mean that we were like a bit fools not to consider about doing what really professional people were telling us. But what I know I've got secure you anyhow because I love Hundred feet below Susan